ProLin PLN. Hello, this is Tony Lyle, a CAM application engineer at ProLim. In this snack bite, I'm going to show a quick demonstration on feature based machining in an XCAM. Let's take a look at our file setup. Here you'll notice we have basically just a dumb solid, which means there's no features associated, there's no whole callouts. Um, this is imported from GrabCAD just as a parasolid. I copied it and created a blank as well. I'll show you that. I'll hide that back away. Uh, you'll see here there are no tools associated with the part. Here's our workpiece and our program order view. So we have nothing in here. And what I want to go to is the Machining Feature Navigator. I'm going to find features. And I want to find all the features in my workpiece along the Z vector. And this is going to display all the features that it can find with its recognition in red. So there are the features that it's recognized here, all highlighted. So the first thing I'm going to do with this is I'm going to highlight all the features and I'm going to just group the features. Okay, and now I can see in my geometry view all the features that are grouped together that are like features. Those are all the features that have the same variables. Now I'm going to go back to my machining feature navigator and select all the features and I will create feature processes. I'm going to create all milling and drilling operations. And now it's going to look into the library for the associated tools that it needs to drill or mill all of those features that it defined. Once it finds the, the drills and mills that it needs, it's going to create operations associated to those. So now it's created operations. So if we go to our operation navigator, we can see operations in these sub programs. So I'm going to start on the program parent and generate the tool paths. So here it's found all of our tools and created operations for us. And we're simply generating the tool paths. Okay, so here's a list of our tools that it found. And here's our program order view again. Let's verify those tool paths. So that's pretty quick and easy operation creation for, for a part that you may not know what the features measure, what the features are, what diameters the holes are, multiple holes. And we can quickly create operations for these. Thank you for watching the snack bite. Check out more pro lunch snack bites and lunch bites. Thank you. Pro Lynn PLN.